those of us you know who are in the business of persuasive communication or development communication have long realized that the domain of public health communication or health communication management you know occupies an important position at no other time has this realization become more self evident than it has in the last year or so my presentation deals with three aspects of covid-19 okay to begin with it focuses on the tensions and contradictions between an emerging covid-19 science its vicissitudes and the confusion that inevitably follows it and that i think i'm going to speak at length on this particular aspect so we need to understand you know how science actually works and how people like you and me basically you know who are not scientists interpret it and that i think is going to be the brunt of my presentation uh and then i move on to a relatively recent phenomenon that the world has begun to pay attention to which is you know misinformation the discussion here focuses on the spate of covid-19 related information or misinformation that institutions and organizations national and international have to deal with i basically do this you know i want to capture and categorize what misconceptions you know and misinformation certain sections of society share you know about covid-19 and discuss very very briefly you know what why they do so finally the presentation deals with the issue of covid-19 related stigma persons suffering from several health conditions encounter stigma and discrimination as do persons with covid-19 this presentation discusses who is stigmatized in covid-19 you know and why okay interspersed in the discussion of different themes i have mentioned our references to some concepts of behavioral change while doing so i examine the covid-19 pandemic from the public's perspective the question i am seized with is this why do people behave the way they do when they are told that doing so would encounter risk